Well, after a fire destroyed a Sanford home, firefighters are working to get results. The first happened last, the fire happened last Friday, and the home did not have any working smoke alarms. Today, firefighters work to change that. As News 6's Mark Lehman explains, it is getting results in Seminole County. Out here in Sanford, warning signs have been placed on this home less than a week after it was gutted by fire. Officials say if it had a smoke detector, that could have been the first line of defense against the flames. That's why firefighters are back in this neighborhood getting results for fire safety. I see you have one right there. Do you have any more in, in the house? Firefighters with Seminole County in Sanford going door to door in the Lincoln Heights neighborhood. Crews installing dozens of smoke alarms at homes free of charge. It's vitally important. Three out of five home fire deaths occur in homes that do not have working smoke alarms. The fire safety blitz coming after flames swept through a home on Harding Avenue last Friday. No one was hurt, but the house, which didn't have smoke alarms, was a total loss. I found out that my neighbor had lost everything. It was pretty sad. Brenda Knight lives right next door and had one smoke detector installed today. It's just good to have a smoke detector. Crews also offering bed shakers for those who are hard of hearing. These are activated by a traditional smoke alarm and then sends a signal and this will shake the bed. Last year, Seminole County installed more than 5,700 alarms as part of a federal grant, many in underserved areas, all of it to prevent a potential tragedy. For those who weren't home today, firefighters placed a hang tag with safety tips and details of their community outreach program. We posted a link with information about that under this story on clickorlando.com. In Seminole County, Mark Lehman, getting results, News 6.